fair. Oh, hell yeah. Get in here, Dodo. Sam Rowney been making some waves these last couple of weeks. Wins on Fjord, wins on Lagoshi Fan 37. Was Sam Rowney seated to get here? Uh, I bull. Uh, let me see. No, he upset Schultz to get here. Gotcha. I was curious about that. Yeah, but still guaranteed another top 24 entry right now. Got a lead. See what he can do with it. This is going to be a tough one for Retrobot. He's a big Steve fan. It's going to be hard for him to hit Steve. He's going to feel bad about it every time. Yeah, exactly. It's just like a sacrifice. That it's like something you really don't want to sacrifice, you know? Because yeah, exactly. Steve being that. Yeah, the that's character how that Retrobot wanted for so long. <laughs> what is he doing? <laughs> that would have killed him, that side B, if it missed. It's Thankfully, kind of just getting knocked back down to Earth instead. Ooh, does not shield the, the down... Oh, wait! Oh, I think he maybe could have... Oh, he has no iron. If he had iron there, he could have, like, jumped minecarted, but he had nothing. Yeah. This Can't... is... Ooh, Ooh. that killed? Oh, I mean, I guess that makes sense, that killed. Yeah, a little bit of rage in the top platform, Steve being a bit light. I don't think he DI'd that correctly, if I look at that correctly. And Yeah. Well, he's already at 56. This character's so dumb. Yeah, yeah, no, he's kind of, he's kind of farming him. It's really hard to play Steve without uh, materials. Yeah. And Samurai's been finding himself in a lot of this kind of situations for the last set he played on stream as well. That's another That's kill. also, that one was, I don't think he would have lived, but that was bad DI as well. Because he was going straight up. Yeah, down throw, thrust uppercut, kills obscenely early. Especially if you're holding in. Oh, yeah. But yeah, this is, this is going to be a hard comeback to mount. Especially when you, like, you can't shield because me Brawler can just wait and side B you. It's really hard to get a comeback on me Brawler. Mm -hmm. He's so solid. Like, he just nares, he side Bs, and he shield. And having great vertical uh, mobility as well, so, like, can make these really well platform camping and stuff as well. Yeah. With the Walmart flip kick. No, a bit more. bro, that's the bougie flip kick. A uh, true, true. Zero Suit has the bad flip kick. <laughs> so true. But yeah, this is going to be a tough one for, for Samaroni. Even with a Steve stock, you're, like, even, like, a zero to death. You're still looking at a big deficit. Yeah, Nair just beats out Minecart straight up. That move is really, really good. Yeah, it's, well, probably not the beginning, because I think the beginning is, like, invincible, or as armor. Oh, oh tough that's SD. unfortunate. Yeah, so the Nair is probably going to be able to beat out, like, late Minecart, but if he if he tries to do it in the startup of the Minecart, he's going to he's gonna lose. Yeah, I think it was a pretty good start from Samurai, then Retrobot just kind of woke up and was like, wait, what am I doing? And did his me brawler shenanigans, and then yeah, just... I... He got nearly zero to death after the first up he had a shield. Pretty much. Which is not what you want to see. Yeah. It's really difficult to know to expect since no one really plays this character, but this character can cheese you super, super easily. No, this character's stupid. Confirm. Oh, this extremely, character's extremely, stupid. extremely. I would much rather play against the Rob than a me brawler any day. Yeah. Samaroni has the same issue that I do, which is... I don't know if he doesn't know how to or if he just chooses not to, but building the wall is so broken. Camping with Steve is literally optimal, and if you're not doing it, you're probably playing a pretty crappy Steve. <laughs> Which is no shame to Samaroni, because he's doing everything else properly, but I think that's he's running into these resource issues. And if he's camping, you know, setting up the wall, mining more, he would not have those issues. Yeah, exactly. I feel like he's interacting... Interesting. As yeah. I was saying, he's interacting, I think, a bit too much, just having a general disregard for his resources most of the time. Yeah. Like, he... There... Uh, Retrobot flip kicks past him to the other side of the stage, and instead of mining, he tries to like chase him. And Steve doesn't really have that speed. Like once they're gone, they're gone. You, you're not catching them. Yeah. So you gotta just mine during that time. But he's keeping it. He's keeping it really good. I mean, he's in the lead. Ooh, does not confirm off of the. Ooh, bit of spaghetti there. Yeah. <gasps> Ooh. Got not quite the way would have envisioned it necessarily with Sam Rowney still taking that first stock off that interaction. Like, yeah, Wait, really. dad yeah. won? Yeah, Nair just beats my kite. That's silly. <laughs> that was like when it was invincible or something. What yeah. the hell? <laughs> Nair just beats my kite. Me brawler's stupid. That's fucked up. <laughs> oh, spot dodges. I want to see more up tilt combos. I feel like he's doing up tilt into into uh, jab. Which he, and he's not getting the damage that he'd get off like an up tilt, right? Up tilt's a guaranteed 50, even with the most basic of combos. Basically, especially with the the better materials like gold and diamond, you can get even more percent just because yeah. of how much, much stronger each individual hit is. And I know I've seen Samaroni do you know block building combos. You can get even more than that. Oh, mm -hmm. see there he did a uh, 
he did a cute little block place and then he did the down tilt and drops the fire but then it cancels the lag when the block disappears that mm -hmm. looks pretty pretty nice setup because you can get good combos off of it yeah i don't really know much about how to commentate steve i just know he minds and he has a lot of nonsense that's all you need to know that's fair if he does something oh Speaking did that extend nonsense. it did that extend the hitbox i think it might have yeah yeah that was unfortunate I'm not sure about the TNT placements randomly. Oh, good down smash. Yeah, still, that's something Retrobot would do a lot if he knows you're just going to hang out in the air a lot. He'll throw out that up B hole. It's, it's a lot of good vertical space and a lot of good base knockback. So if you're just kind of high up towards the top last zone, it's just going to kill you really early. Yeah, and people pun or panic so they don't punish it. <laughs> exactly. Be included. Yeah, I'm in the same boat. It's also just a factor of me <laughs> falling so fast, you know? Yeah. That one definitely should have been like an up tilt though, because up tilt just covers both sides. I think he choked a little or messed up a little bit, but he's still keeping it competitive. He's not out of it, but oh, actually, I looked at his resource bars. It's looking kind of rough. You're not really having any space to retreat and get all those resources back as soon as I say that. Yeah. Having no iron is probably like you're playing a pretty mediocre character. Yeah, iron he, is super necessary. He did the fox there, the weak Nair to up smash, but it didn't kill. Yeah. Interesting fact he actually has that. He also has Nair F smash. Yeah, yeah, like weak Nair smash or like mid percents that can just randomly kill if it's frame perfect. He's basically Fox. Ooh, nope. Yeah, there wasn't really anything better there. Ooh! Letting that up be fly. Samaroni. Wait, is he gonna edge guard? Ooh, does not try to. Is he dead? Good mash. I kind of wanted to see a down tilt there. Ooh. Ooh. I think the lack of resources really killed Samaroni there. Yeah. He threw out an R, I think it might have been a down air or something, but he just didn't have anything, and then Retrobat was able to flip kick back to stage and take that set for himself. I think I think that spot dodge was a little too 